whatever it is, back from its MOT, a successful OT, it has passed, had a load of work done to it to get it to pass. The stuff that needed done to it to get it to go through its MOT was a new ABS pump, a pair of coil springs on the front because one was broken, two new brake calipers on the back because the brakes weren't working, the calipers had seized so they stand up so long whilst we're looking for an ABS pump to put on it. So all that's been done, it's all been fixed. It's now got a full I want to say, a couple of advisories on it that need doing, but everything's fine, it's running great. The other thing we're going to do, just a little bit different, is we're going to change the wheels. So at the moment, it sits on these 17-inch five-spoke rims. They're quite a nice-looking rim. They're all right, there's nothing wrong with them. They're 17 inches, and we've got 45 series tyres on them. What we're going to do, we're going to change those ones, and we're going to put the original wheels back on, the ones that came with it, when the car was bought. Now, I do have the centre caps on, they're over there on the doorstep, but these ones are going back on. As I said, these are 15 inch rims, decent amount of tyre tread on them, so they're going to go back on. I've done three wheels. I'm on to the last one now. the last wheel to go on. I do have new wheel nuts designed for these wheels. So they're going to be okay. Right, that's all five on, all four on rather. Now if this has air, enough air in it, should be able to let the car down, get the jack out. Let's find out, shall we? I'll put the centre caps on and let you see what it looks like when they're all on and complete. I think there's a centre cap missing though. I'll have a quick search see if I can find it and then uh, we'll get the ones we've got on if I haven't got all of them and see what it looks like with them all on. Well it looks like there's only three centre caps. That's what they look like. The Mustang emblem in the middle of the galloping horse in the middle of them and they just tap on. Right, look at the reels, a quick white wolf over the rag, make it look a bit cleaner, and then I'll back off, let you see what it looks with a full set on. I'll just give them all a quick clean. Obviously it's not going to be perfect, we want washing, just because they've been in storage for a while. These actually came with the car, like I said earlier. So I thought we'll put them back on. I said they are going to need a proper clean, but gets the dust off them a little bit anyway. And this is what it looks like with the original wheels on. Now, they don't fill the arches which is a bit of an annoyance you know at the back definitely doesn't fill that arch what's it look like from behind we'll be able to see full of sun you can't really see full of sun can you yeah it definitely doesn't fill that arch out like there's definite gap there still Oh, no, one of the original wheels on. So there we are. Original 1996 Ford Mustang wheels. Don't have that centre cap, unfortunately. You know, it might be in the car somewhere, or it might be in storage or parts of some other cars. But at least 
the roll on now. That's it then. A fresh MOT on the Mustang. So an entire year, whole 12 months to enjoy the Mustang in what looks to be fantastic weather. Just in time for the good weather. The original wheels are back on. What do you think of them? The, the five spokes that were on it beforehand or the original three spokes that are on now? Drop a comment below and let me know. I think they're a bit of a Marmite wheel. Might get used to them. They don't seem to fill the arches as much as I thought they would. But then the old ones that came off were so much wider. I think these must be a, a five or a six inch. The ones that came off are a seven or an eight inch, I think. But let me know below what you think about them. Anyway, it's time for the Mustang to go back to its owner. And uh, we'll get on with something else. See you next time. Bye for now.